Ba -be -ba -be 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 -ba. Hey there everyone, this is our girl playing Cave Story. So we beat the game, and then we beat the game, and then we beat the pose game. So of course there's more. Alright, so it is my understanding that Wind Fortress is actually something that was created by Pixel and was meant for the original game, but when they did the re-release, uh, Pixel agreed to like finish it and make it prepared for this. So, naturally, that sounds super rad, super interesting, and that's what we're doing last. I think that makes a lot of sense, right? Uh, Machine Gun Challenge and Nemesis Challenge, I don't know who made those, but I think that conceptually, that seems pretty straightforward. So let's do the two things, well, let's look at the two things that kind of interest me the least. Uh, Sanctuary Time, by the way, like, we're not gonna actually do. Okay, so here you get a heal, that's like permanent. Oh! Do you have access to recording replay, it says up there. That's weird. Don't do that. So that's the gun, fireball, bubble, sword, nemesis, and other gun, I guess. Like, like which, which is that? That's right, I got the polar star. So you can't have the machine gun? Okay, so they are mutually exclusive. See, this is interesting, I find. Should probably bring the nemesis, but like, everything else I do not use. So you get here, you get a ridiculous amount of increase. You get a down arrow. See, look at that, now I can go. No, wait, I need missiles. Okay, you already got, what do you have? That. Yeah, but missile launcher isn't there, which is interesting. Then you follow the ROM hack down arrow, and the black wind through blew your body. And look at that, it's the hell run. Uh, once again. Except I can't power up my missiles this time, because that was not available. So yeah, I think it makes sense to do this as part of this package. Because it's my understanding, like a different- Oh, but you don't get the hell there, and then I messed up. Ah, oh, this dang place! Uh, no. Okay, replay last probably just plays it. Actually, I kinda do wanna check something real quick. Alright, really I only need the spur. If I could have the machine gun, I'd bring that. You know, there's a little HUD we got to see. That's- Oh man, come on. Uh, play that. There we go. See, that was not difficult. I've done this, like, a few times, but, I mean, that's... Goes back down to what I I said once, though. Like, it, this is the hardest part. Okay, so I did not have a tow rope, but I did have a tow rope. Because I was wondering if they were gonna be offering a... Like, is this a... Uh, a curly-less run? Like, is that... Well, I mean, if you want to do that... I guess you can just not talk to her? Like, is that an option? To... I guess so, or like, I don't know if like the door would stop you or something. I don't see why. Like, it's just... but clearly is part of a cutscene, like, at the start, so... Yeah, no, that wouldn't work. So, by the way, people have been wondering why I didn't get the hearts, um, at the start. So, my reasoning is a bit strange, perhaps, but I think it makes sense. Uh, the reason why I did this is because, you see, enemies drop hearts, right, and they fade away. So, you need to grab them when you can, and then, you know, and then you get some healing done. But the permanent hearts stay there forever. So, I think it is a better idea to heal using the unpermanent hearts, and make sure I use them all up, before then I go and rely on the permanent ones. Like I said, I don't know if that makes sense, but it made sense to me, because this means that in theory, you could end up with uh, a higher total of parts, you know, of healing potential than otherwise. So it's an extremely long view type of strat, but I mean, I made it work because I I mean, I make it work because I just don't get hurt all that often during the level itself. Uh, like, 
being real here. Oh, I don't have the whimsical star, and that was not an option. So it's. I think it's interesting how uh, this is an option, but you don't have like missile packs. I mean, unless I somehow did not see them at the start. Like they're just not there. Like you're probably gonna you get your missile from the missile uh, box later in the level. But then that means like like are they gonna be super missiles? Are they gonna be good? You don't get to like charge them up. Other than by like at the boss itself or something like that. I don't know. It's a. Uh, I think it's interesting. Whoop. But yeah, like you don't get like the whimsical star, for example. Oh, come on, man, don't stop messing. So no matter, like, so it's not going to be like your build. It's not, but it's still, still. I appreciate that it exists as I keep playing it. Where is the relief? There's supposed to be like relief angels coming on. I need to destroy this guy at the bottom, actually. And I've just done this so often, like, I just, I have a thing. And that's why, in during my first attempt at this, I was commenting on how bored I was, because that's the thing, like, after a while, like, I have a system that works. It's not very fast, though, so, you know, if I was trying to, it wouldn't work for the purposes of speedrunning this thing, which is something that I know people do on purpose. And, uh, I accept that, but, uh, yeah, um... If you are not speedrunning, and you are taking this cautiously, this does get tiresome real quick, real fast. It's kind of no way around it. That's just how it would be, man. Because, yeah, like, some people would have already beaten, like, the whole thing by now, it's my understanding. I guess I can see it. If you just rush, and you let, like, the Relief Angel soldiers, like, pile up, I can see that being a thing. I don't intend to finish though, so you know what? I've been meaning to figure, find out how much bombs hurt. So let's do that real quick. One. Only 12? Oh. I figured it'd be way more than that. Oh wait, the missile pack isn't up there. So you just don't get missiles? Uh, oh, that's a weird decision. So you just are not allowed to use missiles in this version of the thing. Why? That just seems odd to me. I mean, maybe the missiles were there and I didn't see them. It's not impossible. It wouldn't be the first time something ridiculous like that happened. But yeah, this is not a serious attack because, yeah, like, I didn't heal up or anything. I wonder if it's because of Heavy Press that you have the ability to, uh, that, um, girl shoots up with you. You know, normally she shoots at your back, but if you're aiming up, like, she will be shooting upward with you, and I wonder if it's because of heavy press, where that becomes extremely relevant. The timer stops during cutscenes, that's pretty good. I wouldn't have thought that. Cannot open a door while you're charging your gun. Important lessons about the world. Wow, completely useless. Alright, how do you escape? I don't, you cannot escape. You cannot, oh no, yeah, you could press this button. No, it just opened up, okay. Weird. So open a menu and press escape, but that boots you out. All right, fair enough. Now boss attack. Again, I'm not gonna finish boss attack, but like with hell, I'm curious to see if there's like a little hub or something, you know? So it starts with Polar Star, starts me with this. Hey Cthulhu, see, look at that. Weapon trades. Uh, so we can just walk in there. There are mini healths here. There's a statue. Oh, because we're going to be fighting. Wait, what? So this is the Balrog fight. Oh, and as we progress, we get more things. I have no jets or anything. Here's a wall. Yeah, okay. I see. So you just can't be all loaded up. So we're going to go here. Balrog! We're at the shack, which the cyber sh Oh, this gun barely goes anywhere. You know, I should have powered it up. I didn't even do that. Even though there's the power-up stations and whatnot. Whoa! Check out that mighty leap. Uh, 
this mighty toaster showcase. To... Okay, you gotta shoot them, and then you get the thing. Okay, I see. That's really cool. So yeah, so that opened up this door, and here's Igor. Whoa, what a fool. And you can, they make it very clear what is where. So now we've got missiles, and uh, I'm gonna put nine missiles to max. Why not? This is kind of cool. That's uh, yeah, it's Igor. Who feels ready for Igor? It's Igor time, we'll check it out, it's Igor, the stomping guy Igor, he tried to punch Igor, he's screaming out Igor, what a fool, well now you're dead, and then you get fireball for free, and then all these bots, these bots, these pots return and you can just power them all back up, it goes real fast. Ah, you know what? If you're gonna make something like this, this is the way to do it. And you can decide, will you ever use Bubbler? Maybe. So I'm gonna take that and call it Bubbline, which is weird. I hate it. Here you get extra stuff. This is real cool. Whoops, not what I meant to do. Well, I did, I bust that open to be able to level that up though, so. Alright, well, uh, oh wait, I can touch that to free up my things though, so that's all good. Alright, well, hey, it's... Alright, oh, you're not really... It's Balrog! In the power supply room, we'll go check it out, Balrog. Oh yeah, you do have wings here. Okay, I don't know why I forgot that. But yeah, just get real close. And let the firestorm ring supreme! I mean, I got hurt. Whoa. I got leveled down, I got hurt so bad. That was a bad fight. But it's okay, nothing gets learned today. Because I can just get healed back right away. Words. Here's a frog for you. Frog for me, frog for you. It's Balrog. You gotta press next to the arrow. Balrog, but it's Balfrog Gum! Whoops, uh, I just pressed buttons. Whoops, I just let a frog fall on me. It's pretty good. Uh, wow, I'm just bad at this. Oh, wait, no. I'm using the right thing. Isn't this supposed to, like, utterly decimate it? Because I'm not seeing it. And now I'm almost dead, too. As an extra fun little bonus. Maybe it's because I got hurt too quick or something. I mean, I'll believe it. Like, I just kind of went into him and then got busted up open for space crimes, so... Shoot in your open mouth! Frog ray for me! I guess there's a world where you might want to run underneath them, but that sounds really dumb. Alright, I might be able to do it. I have to remember that health is just kind of low at this stage of the game. So don't freak out because of that. Oh, and then a frog just kind of fell on me. Very rude, Mr. Froggy. Very rude. Feed it about wrong, about frog. And see, nothing is learned because I can just get my things back. What did I lose? Alright, you're now all the way quack. It's quacking time, check it out, it's a girl I know. Her name is Curly. Not like her hair. And all right, there's more stuff going on here. Curly! It's Curly! Check it out, she's there! She, oh, I just got shot down there. I just kind of stood there. I still don't have movement pack. Well, see, normally, oh, this is where you do the exchange. Yeah. Uh, you can't just stay in the door and make yourself invincible. You are not Link. This is not Link's Game Boy game. Oh, I might die here. Ah, man. All right. Well, I did die here. What happens if I retry? You restart from the start. That's what I want to find out. But that's really cool. Like, I don't know. I played bad there. I don't know why I played bad there. Like, I don't know what I did wrong, but I clearly did something wrong, but that's fine. 
I think I just wasn't used to the polar star anymore, and I just kind of played badly because of that. I should have changed like a fireball or something. But this is cool, like there's a whole thing. I, I don't want to do it because... Uh, no, I'm not, uh, let's do it a little. I'm changing my mind apparently. I want to... There's something I want to see. Oh wait, I forgot to take health. Like, there was health, right? Yeah. So, Fireball, you don't have a choice. You are getting Fireball, whether you want to or not. Bumbler is useful against Weapon X, so I should take it. What? What? Wait, what did I just pick? Oh, that was- that were- So there's hearts there I didn't pick last time, that's pretty good. They were hidden. That's mean, don't hide things. I like using the bubbler against this fight, and we'll do that. I'm- wrong fight! Oh, what hit me there. There you go. Want to get rid of a frog? You use bubbles. This doesn't make sense, but it works. Uh, full of everything. Get an extra heart here. Yeah, I have more health than I was when I got here the first time because I made a mistake. Point blank fire, and then you ruin it for me. That is pretty rude. Just do a big jump. Wow, I'm just, I just melted you away this time. Yeah, that's what happens when you use the right weapon for the right purpose. I would like to get my fire back, please. And now it's so still, I did not have a chance to switch my gun. Or anything. Well, maybe it's gonna be over here? Yeah, like I'm still on the pull star as we approach Omega. That's what I've been wondering about. Like, what's up with that little truce? I don't know. Whoa. It's like starting like right there, huh? He's already sort of attacking, and look at all those fun little gears popping up everywhere, uh, filling the void in my heart. Uh, I use violence for that purpose. Okay, let's go underneath. You don't have to move all that much. Look at that flawless diverker. Versus Omega! He's not that. And I got a life pot for me. Because you get things in an obligatory way. All the time. Like, there's a possibility that there was a thing a machine gun, but if there was, I didn't see it, I don't got- Maybe it's because I didn't unlock it in my real game. Uh, what am I talking about? Like, cause what I- the reason why I've been doing this is I've been wondering if I could unlock the um, rabbit Turoko. Oh, this is a lot easier to see where it can go without the flowers in the middle. Unlock the weapon I- I never got, you know? Flower beneath. Whoa, uh, rude. Sometimes I don't play good. Whoa, watch out there, bunny. That's right, I'm calling you a bunny sometimes. Uh, setting the world on fire. The flower gave me a heart. Now my thing leveled up. Now I'm point blanking fireball at your face. How you feel about that? I feel pretty good, but I don't know about you. That was a messy fight that looked bad. Now I got a blade, whether I want to or not. Power up the blade. Give me my buddy king. I want king around. Even though people keep telling me that no, level two is better. Shut up. I want king. All right, so yeah. But yeah, I wonder if like I'm not gonna get 
the option to get um, the replacement weapon because I never got it. Wait, oh, that's solid. That doesn't look like it. Check it out, it's full black. Gross. Think sword is good for you? Oh, this room is tiny! You see, you cut through the shaft, and then you do things all over the place. Then King's Light, we'll oh, check it out, and oh yeah, we're checking, alright? We're checking! I like how they recreate a little desk area. That was very, a very important part of the fight. Okay, well, I guess I can. I can definitely do that for Monster X. Monster X! Oh wow, you even recreate this early part with the roaches, huh? That's a bummer, but I get it. Alright, uh, see, normally I'd have, like, stuff that I can use. Which I don't. That is pretty me. So, here I am, trying something obscene. Oh, already at, uh, like, lots of hell, though. Can I heal with this? Yes, I can. Check it out. There's a guy with horns, maybe. I don't know. Alright, you guys are having fun. But real people are fighting out here, getting hurt in dumb, avoidable ways. Alright, well, I'm getting, like, massacred here, so I'm not thinking I'm gonna do it. I'm okay with, would be told, but yeah, that's just how things be, man. I think, yeah, I, maybe I lost level XP, because, like, my Butler 2 is at level 2, and I don't know what's up with that. Alright, just, yeah, get that sword into that somewhat obscure organ. So obscure, it's bright. Sword is... Yeah, I picked up the bubbler because I was like, I like the bubbler in certain places. This being one of the... Oh man, I keep getting killed by the threats though. Like if there's something in this fight that's gonna kill you, it's the little homing things that are very annoying and getting run over by the threads, which is easy to do. I just keep just slipping off in the worst way, but I guess we're fine. Cat! I saw that cat. And then, it's, and then it's like, that. Ah, we're out of here! Get out! <laughs> I was like, okay. I wanna party back up. I will do that. Yeah, Fireball uh, could use some, though. Well, thank you. Bubbler could use some. I don't know if I'm gonna use Bubbler again. Okay, here we're gonna get Super Missiles. That's exciting, you know. I'm sure some people have been looking forward to that. Right, gonna add some more. What version are you? Oh, you're the version that has a bunch of missiles. You're, you're like the last Balrog player. Right, well, I'm gonna... Fascinating. Yeah, I don't need more or less than that. Oof. Great playing. Oh, and Curly's like down there in prison. How'd you end up there, Curly? Explain yourself! My gun is empty already. But, so, here, there, it gives me a chance for the booster, but not for the gun. I think that's interesting. Like, I do wonder, is it because, like, that's the only run I did in this game? Like, it gives you the minigun challenge, though. Because, like, I never did a machine gun run, oh shoot, uh, like, in this game itself. That was in the original file, right? So, so I just wonder. Arms barrier exists now. Nothing you can do about that, I'm afraid to say. Yeah, I wonder. I opened up the treasure chest, I got super missiles, I can't do anything about it. Would I want to do anything about it? I don't know. Well, here's zombie core. No, it's normal core. It's not zombie. That's a spoiler. <laughs> it really just drops. All right, so this is a hard fight, but I do have boosters, which is gonna help a lot. Yeah, 
I struggle against you a lot. I need to let you come out, actually, is the problem. Let's do that. Let's hang out here. Let's draw him out. Let's draw him the picture. Whoa, check it out, I got all these blades. But what can I do with all these blades? Put them in a saving account and forget they're there. And then regret everything ever done. <laughs> I mean, I guess that's possible. Weird take, though. It's this phase of the fight. I don't know what to do about the orbs! Go to buy. Oh, okay. You know what? Never mind. Uh, my trick for the orbs works a lot better without the boosts. That's kind of funny. Wouldn't have thought that. Uh, man. I really want those hearts. It would have been useful. I mean, I guess I can have this heart. Check it out, it's Swords Town! Welcome to Swords... But now you're going away, and it's annoying. Alright, I guess I'm gonna wait a little bit. Throwing missiles at a pace that he's is ignoring me. That's the way we do things sometimes. Yeah, I'm gonna die, probably. I don't think I'm gonna win. I'm playing just kinda like, slightly too bad. Alright, so yeah, when that happens... Wait here! You hear the sound of the orbs, and that's when you start climbing the stair. There you go, that's how you handle the orbs. It's very easy if you take your time and do it correctly. But, uh... I'm gonna die from other things, probably. Yeah, I'm gonna die of him being super annoying. Alright, we gotta pull him out. Let's just wait here. Feels bad, but... Otherwise, he's just, like, hiding in there. And it's like, ugh. Dude, what are you doing, man? Try to attack all of its attacks. Whoops, okay. Uh, I didn't realize he had used wind, actually. It's good. That's kind of a fair place to get to, I think. Alright, so that's boss attack. There's like that whole surrounding HUD. I thought I would get to choose more things, but I guess I don't. And I wonder if it's because I've only had one playthrough in this game. And it gives you access to the things you found. I would genuinely like to know. Because I don't, and I would like to know. I don't need- I don't need to justify wanting to know things. 